one. In this video, let's have a look at the AICP 12.1 ROM for the Moto X Style or the Moto X Pure. As you can see, it is the 12.1 version nightly and it has the latest security patch level from June. This is the 10th June nightly and this will be more of a general performance update for this room because there has been quite a bit of change in the AICP nightlies from the past say a week and a half because before that each nightly had some or other kind of bug that made it quite unusable for me but now I think it is a very reliable room for me and I always come back to it after testing various rooms as you can see from the playlist down below in the description that I have tested a lot of rooms and I have made a video for each one of them so you can go and have a look at them there as you can see here the gestures work perfectly double twist of camera chops of a torch are here let's move on to the status bar as you can see there are many customization options almost all of the customizations that you can think of in buttons too there are customization options let's move on display here as you can see you can enable ambient display and there are a lot of tweaks here too for the ambient display the ambient display is quick to light up and there have been no instances where I wave to wake the device and it doesn't work it always works for me moving on as you can see here it supports substratum and also it comes with magisk manager inbuilt so that's really nice if you want to use snap apps like snapchat and other apps like netflix that do not support root rooted rooms as you can see here there are a lot of customization options you can edit a hell lot of things as you can see you can with toggle button editor you can change all of these icons at the bottom i'll leave that to you to discover them let's move on to the holy grail of customizations as you can see here there are a lot of options I will just browse through them I will not be explaining each one of them because there are a lot of them just have a look at them talking about the day-to-day -day performance the performance is very smooth and I have had no none at all issues of lagginess or anything the battery life is pretty great too I get around three hours of screen on time with this room and there is also a handy gesture that I will get back to in just a moment I skipped this one okay just have a look yeah so there's also double tap to wake present here for that to work go to kernel audio editor or any kernel app go to wake and then select half and when you do this now the screen is off when I double tap it it lights up it kind of works around 50% of time it's not as accurate as a device that natively natively support this but I think it's pretty good to have this option and it kind of works 50% of time for me as you can see here but if you kind of tap three times it works 100% of times so that's really nice so I think you should definitely give this room a shot because it is pretty stable and I have no notable issues but talking about the issues there are there is one issue when you reboot your device the torch wouldn't work for that to make working just press on this edit icon edit quick settings icon on the top here and then it will say ha pause the device will stop working for 5 10 seconds and then the torch will work work again there will be no issues there and one issue that i have noticed is if you play music while you are walking then the music gets interrupted but if you want to prevent that i take this option prevent accidental wake up and i haven't had that issue but i will have to test it further because yeah and there aren't really any other bugs that i can say that plague this room and this is a pretty great room so thank you for watching this video if you want more videos like this do subscribe and like this video and if you want to have a look at other custom rooms for this device the moto x pure or the moto x style do check the description for the link of playlist. Thank you and have a nice day.